All right, guys, hey, today we are at the North Carolina Museum of Art. We are not actually gonna go into the museum proper. Um, we're gonna go to the museum park, which is kind of this big area outside the park. Um, from what I understand, this museum uh, campus is the largest, at least in America. Um, it was in the Civil War, a uh, military base, and then in World War One it was a military base, um, and then as of, uh, I'm not sure when the actual building opened, but as of 2001, this whole property has uh, belonged to uh, the North Carolina Museum of Art. It's actually a great museum, and I will, in a different day, not today, be going there to show you guys in this video. Um, but for now, we're here to see something really specific. I'm gonna, I'll, br I'll bring you guys along on our way out there, but out in the woods, there's something really cool here at the North Carolina Museum of Art. So let's go. All right guys, we made it through the museum park into the forest. We found our destination. We are at the North Carolina Museum of Art um, cloud chamber for the trees and skies. And if you don't know what a cloud chamber is, it's this little house hut looking thing. Looks like a hobbit house. We're gonna go in and go inside and see if it works. The general idea of it is if you go in and you close the door securely, which we're going to do, um, it'll be pitch black in there. There's a little teeny hole in the, in the ceiling of it. Um, and essentially it should, in theory, project the sky, the sun, the trees, and stuff on the walls. I don't know if any of this is going to show up on video. Actually, I know none of this is gonna show up on camera because I've been here before and I've tried to film it and photograph it and it just doesn't work. Um, but I'll take you in with me. It'll be black for the next little bit and uh, you can uh, let me know or I can narrate for you what uh, is happening in here. So let's go in. Ready to go in, babe? Go in, go in. I'll start with my flashlight on first, okay? So it's not too dark. So there's the flashlight, here we go. A duck because it's very small. There it is. And here we go, turn closed, it's gonna get a little dark. Watch out, babe. Go sit on one of the benches over there. All right, so right now I have my flashlight on. I'm gonna show you, here's the hole in the roof. Essentially is a log roof in here and white cement walls. Here's the little mini door we came in. I'm gonna sit down here, turn uh, my flashlight off and we're gonna, we're gonna see if we can see the sky on the walls. They say it should show up on the walls, okay? Ready, let's, one, two, lights off. Oh, wow. You can see it. Look at all the trees on the walls. And the floor. You can see the trees all over the walls and the floor. That's so crazy. Do you see them, babe? Yeah. Look at it. Look at There's trees on that wall over there. That's so cool. Let me see if there's anything else I can see in here. So I lied before I went in. I said you wouldn't be able to see it because I have been here and I did try to film it before and I couldn't see it. I think I used this camera. Maybe I didn't. Um, but it worked. Like you could see it. I, I think it showed up on camera. It looked like it was showing up. I'm gonna try to like raise the grain in the ISO so it'll be a grainy shot, but you'll be able to see. It, it actually worked. Could you let me know in the comments below if you could see it on camera? Um, but yeah, it basically projected all the trees, which we're seeing here in the forest here. Onto the wall and all it is is this stone structure here that is got a hole in the roof. Like a teeny little circular hole in there. I tried to show it and well, I was in there, but I mean, how cool is that? That like, I'm like kind of blown away. That worked so well. I was really worried about coming to do this because I've done it before and it usually doesn't show up. And I was like, ah, oh, this is going to be kind of boring because you can't really see what you're experiencing, but like it worked extra well this time. Like that was amazing. It's so cool. Here's the light coming through from the sun. But yeah, it's all along the walls here. On camera, it's even showing up kind of like multicolored here. I don't know if it's gonna, when I edit, if it'll be that color, but. Oh my goodness. That's so cool. That was so exciting to me. I don't know if it was at all exciting for you guys, but like, I'm so excited that that worked. Cool, so, but yeah, this is the cloud chamber, North Carolina Museum of Art. Uh, if you park at the park parking lot and then just walk the blue trail till you get to the wooded trail, 
and it's one of the first things you'll see on the wooded trail. Um, it's actually not all that deep in. The biggest part of the walk is walking from the parking lot to the actual woods. Um, and you get to see some other amazing art things along the way too. Uh, thanks for watching today, guys. That was way better than I imagined it was going to be. I'm like beyond excited about that. Oh, <laughs>